and we say bye bye. No traction. <laughs> no traction whatsoever. Here's Project Snowball. So let me give you some context. This is a 2014 FX2 Ford F-150 Tremor. This Tremor is my very first F-150 EcoBoost truck. What's special about the Tremor is the Tremor in 2014 was a one-year truck. This truck came with a 3.5 liter twin-turboed EcoBoost V6 paired to a 6R80 six-speed automatic transmission and a lockable nine and three-quarter rear diff with 14 gears. So this truck from the factory was already fun. What I have done is what you can hear is I have charge pipes, hot side charge pipes, Mishimoto full race intercooler. I have the AFE twin tube cold air intake. I also have yeah, it's always it's also tuned from Brew City Boost on an E30 tune. I have not dynoed it yet. I do have a shift kit with a BM shifter. I have a lowering kit and a box. I have yet to put that on. Um, it's gonna be an axle flip kit. The truck's gonna go to a three-inch front drop and a five-inch, maybe four-inch drop in the rear. So it's gonna be a nice tasteful look. And sometime next year, I'm going to put the Shelby Super Snake Sport rims and tires on it. I'm going to put the 22s on some 305s all around and around and call it a day. This is going to be a stout truck when she's done. And I also have a Catback MBRP 3.5 inch race exhaust that is a. Uh, no resonator, just muffler with two pipes coming out of it. And it goes in front of the right rear wheel. Um, almost like a Ford Lightning style exhaust. Uh, I love it. It sounds great. As you can tell, it's not too much drone. Then you get Forza noises. <laughs> I have yet not, I have yet to dyno this truck the way it sits. I did dyno the truck the day I bought it, so not bad for a first gen EcoBoost. But yeah, when I did dyno it, um, I put 296 horse to the rear tire and about 315 foot-pounds of torque, 315, 316 foot-pounds of torque. That was to the wheels, stock, non-touch, not even unlocked, limited to 95 freaking mile an hour on the roller dyno. So. Hopefully you guys approve. Yeah.